Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. So I decided to record this foundation routine. This isn't really like an everyday foundation routine. It's more of a something special foundation routine. So keep watching. Okay, step one. I'm using this primer from the body shop called Wonder Blur. I dropped it on my lap by accident. <laughs> I'm just gonna gently put that all over my face and focus on my T-zone where my pores are bigger. Please and music. Step number two, color correcting. I'm gonna use this Orange Pro Concealer by LA Girl. I'm pretty sure this concealer was only like two or three ninety nine, and I got it from the beauty supply. So I'm gonna put that concealer under, I mean on top of where all my dark spots are, like under my eyes, around my mouth, next to my nose. And the beauty blender I'm using is by Real Techniques. For foundation, I'm gonna be using NARS Sheer Glow in the color New Orleans. It's lightweight with medium to full coverage and has a really natural skin like finish. The next step is concealing my under eyes and highlighting the eye points of my face with MAC Pro Longwear Concealer in NC45. This is my all time favorite day one concealer. This is the only concealer. I got a sample of the Pro Longwear in NC50. I just wanted to try mixing it with the NC45. Um, this is just like an extra step. Extra. You don't really have to do this. And I'm using the same Real Techniques Beauty Blender. I'm blending all of that. I also take some NARS Creamy Foundation in the color cartoon, I forgot to show it, but I use my Morphe um, Contouring Brush to put that on all the low points in my face. The same place is where I put the foundation stick. And then I'm just going to blend that in with the Sephora Blending Brush. I'm going to put the names or numbers of all the brushes and products that I use. So if you want to know, don't forget to check the description box below. This next step is setting my highlight. So I'm gonna use Ben Nye's setting powder in Topaz and a damp beauty blender. And instead of baking, I'm just gonna press in all the powder in my eyes. I think this prevents creasing better than baking does. Next, I'm gonna do some reverse contouring with the same beauty blender. So this time I'm gonna bake under the hollow points of my cheek just to bring out my contours. Now I'm going in with this NARS powder in Benares and this big fluffy Morphe brush. I'm just gonna buff out my whole face, including the areas where I first contoured. Finishing step is to spray your whole face with some Fix Plus. 